Today, scientists are looking elsewhere to find a planet suitable for life like ours. They mostly look for planets of a similar mass, temperature, size and atmospheric composition to Earth. Our galaxy, the Milky Way, is a humongous place approximately 100,000 light years across. There are an estimated 200 billion stars in our galaxy, with most having one or more planets orbiting them. As a result, searching for alien life might look like looking for a needle in a haystack. According to NASA's Exoplanet Exploration page, astronomers have found about 4,000 exoplanets after the first such planet was confirmed, orbiting a sun-like star in 1995. More than 50% of these discoveries are made by NASA's Kepler Space Telescope, launched in 2009 on a mission to determine how common Earth-like planets might be lurking in the Milky Way galaxy. Discovering the first actual alien Earth is a long-held dream of astronomers. So far, exoplanet discoveries have shown that small rocky worlds like ours are abundant in the galaxy. But to qualify as potentially life-friendly, a planet must be relatively small, rocky and orbits in the habitable zone of its sun. This is where water can exist in liquid form on a world's surface. While Earth number two remains indefinable, here are the closest known twins to our planet. Number one, Glaze 667 CC. Glaze 667 CC is about 22 light years away from Earth and is about 4.5 times as big as Earth. According to NASA, Glaze 667 CC completes one orbit around its star in 28 days but it is a red dwarf and is a fair amount cooler than our sun. So the planet is thought to be located in the habitable zone. Number 2. Kepler 62f Kepler 62f lies about 1,200 light years away. NASA says that the planet is about 40% larger than Earth and orbits a star much cooler than our sun. The planet's 267-day orbit puts it evenly within the green zone. Kepler-62 orbits closer to its red dwarf sun than Earth does to its star, but the star produces much less light. Number 3. Kepler-442b This exoplanet is 33% larger than Earth, which completes an orbit of its sun every 112 days. Kepler-442 was discovered in 2015. A study done in 2021 discovered that Kepler-442b may receive enough light to sustain a significant biosphere. The researchers analyzed the likelihood of different planets being able to do photosynthesis. It was found that Kepler-442b receives sufficient radiation from its star. Number 4 Kepler-1649c This planet was discovered by NASA's Kepler Space Telescope in 2015. This exoplanet is similar in size to Earth and orbits its star's habitable zone. When the initial data was collected from the telescope, a computer algorithm mistakenly identified the planet as an astronomical body. But later, in 2020, it was discovered to be a planet. Scientists also found that this planet receives 75% of Earth's light from the Sun. Number 5. Proxima Centauri b According to NASA, this planet is located just 4 light years away from Earth, making it Earth's closest known exoplanet. The planet was discovered in 2016 and had a mass 1.27 times that of Earth. Even though the exoplanet can be found in the star's habitable zone, it is exposed to dangerous ultraviolet radiation. The reason is that it lies very close to its sun and has an orbital period of just 11.2 days, making it more unstable than the rest. Number 6. TRAPPIST-1e This is not a planet but a habitable set of planets that orbits the star, TRAPPIST-1. 
These are the closest Earth-sized planets ever discovered in the habitable zone of a star. This solar system is made up of seven planets in total. According to NASA, water on most of these planets are likely to have evaporated early in the system's formation. Nevertheless, a 2018 study found that some of these planets could hold more water than Earth's oceans, most of which exist as ice and as water vapor. But one of its worlds, TRAPPIST-1e, is believed to be the most likely to support life as we know it. Scientists believe we can develop technology in the coming decades that would enable us to do space travel at incredibly high speeds. But even if we do, the voyage to the nearest exoplanet would still take hundreds of years. But one thing is clear, nothing can stop the human race from reaching these planets. Do you think aliens will be discovered in your lifetime, possibly on one of these planets? Let us know in the comments below.